The bacteria Legionella was discovered lurking in the water at St. Patrick Hospital, prompting the hospital to do what it can to clean its water. MTN's Eric Clemens spoke with an infectious disease specialist about how it got there and what's being done to combat it. Legionella is the bacteria responsible for Legionnaire's disease, a type of pneumonia. Recently, a patient at Missoula's St. Patrick Hospital was infected with the bacteria. Subsequent water tests came back positive for Legionella inside the hospital's water supply. A phenomena that's not uncommon. It typically is found in water. It lives naturally in fresh water. It's in all the rivers and lakes and worldwide, really. And it, it can live in piping of water systems, and it often does. In order for the bacteria to cause any damage or make anyone sick, it's got to be aerosolized and inhaled into the lungs. One of the most common places that can happen in a hospital is right here in the shower. That's why this shower head has been fitted with a medical grade filter. Hospital staff are working to contain the bacteria so the water supplies can be properly treated. It's not something that some with a normal immune system or you know, normal lung function would have to worry about. However, as a hospital, St. Pat's houses some people with less than perfect immune systems. And doctors are doing everything possible to prevent infection. If someone with an impaired immune system or some problem with their lungs were to, uh, to inhale it, they could potentially get a pneumonia from it, an infection. And it can be severe. It can be life-threatening. Hospital staff say they hope to have the bacteria contained and eliminated over the coming days. And Dr. Christensen is confident that there will be no complications. My wife and I are having a baby next week, and we're going to have them here at the hospital, and I don't have any concerns. So. In Missoula, Eric Clements, MTN News. Now, hospital tells us they're providing boiled uh, bottled water and keeping patients up to date on that contamination.